of muffled, but audibly like, What's happening? Don't know. This is really thick stone walls. The you see them in the front door, but there seems to be a lot of noise. Maybe there's a distraction going on. Okay. Or you can tune into his PDA and you hear like, Hey, what are you doing here? Why do you glow like that? Oh, this is crazy. What is he? The golden flame? No, he is the evil thing. <laughs> the blasphemer. Oh, no. The door now. Do you have persuasion or where you can convince him? <clears throat> Let me are... see. My charisma is not bad. It's not good, mm-hmm. but not bad. I've come to worship at your temple. I was drawn here by some divine energy and we'll find out how that goes for him <laughs> we're gonna sneak nice. in the back door but we're gonna find out what happens to you guys first we're as you sneak in, in the back boy. door all right so uh as you go in through the back door we'll go ahead and set up your miniatures of yourself all right so as you enter the first room through the back door you notice that there are five doors off of that. So, who's, let's see, the I'm, hacker. I'm going back. So we come in and these are all doorways. Is this you? Yes. Okay. So Ninja Lady, uh, Sam Jackson, and the evil monk. All right. So that is where you are right now. When you enter the room, you see five doorways, each of them sealed, each of them with engravings and markings on them. It is up to you what you find out about the room once you're in. The PDA would only tell you this room leads to the next room that you need to get to. So we know which room we need to go in. Oh, you said this room that we're in. Like, this room that you're in, you know, connects to another room that you need to get to in order to keep going. But we don't know which door that is. There's Correct. five of us. Okay. Can we each peek in a door? That is completely possible. That seems like the fastest way to see what's in each room. Okay. Well, then it's up to you. Just each one of you tell me if you agree with her plan. Um, just peek in. Sound there. logic. Don't go in. Like just. It's peek sound in. logic. So sound logic. you can go ahead and just tell me which number on the door number it is. one number Which one are three. you three so no he's you want to go through number monk, five the brown guy okay so number one for itchy because i cannot say whatever it is which there. one are you ninja and you're in which one three. No, oh, i died so put her in three i don't really care what uh he's like. going Nick through Fury, one where are you going yeah, me. i've got a five. uh chuck wanted five i think oh i said you want five yeah. Okay. You can both go through five. I'll go four then. That's fine. Four. Is Chuck Batman? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I'm still invisible, right? Yeah. Okay. Just yeah. checking. All right. So we'll go ahead and start off with Jessica or Cat. We're just peeking, right? We're not going in. You're opening the door discreetly. No, I'm just opening it. <laughs> I'm opening it discreetly. You're. I'm like. I'm Peaking assuming it's not going to creak, right? All right. Like, what no. number did you go to? Two. Do I need to roll to see stuff? Okay. So as you enter the room. I'm not entering. I'm peeking in. Okay. So as, as you peek as you in the room. Stick your head in the door. You see that it is another dark room with one door. Oh, boy. Okay. I'm going to follow this through with you before I go to each person. I mean, I'm going to tell them what I'm seeing. You're just going to turn around and tell them there's... Well, there's it's a dark room. room. All we're doing is peeking in to see what's in each room. Is it going to be all this, all rooms with just a dark room and a door? You never know. No. You don't know yet. Okay. Or yes. I'm going or to maybe. tell them this is a dark room with another door inside. Perhaps. Okay. Because there's no reason for me to go in there by myself. Let's figure out what's in all the other rooms first. <laughs> so you're leaving it at that? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Closing the door back. Well, I mean... I'd say yes. <laughs> Is it a dark, a empty room? It is a dark, empty attack room with yeah, one door inside open, of it. You have to attack the dark. I'm place. just standing here. Okay. Itchy, which room did you go into? Number one. Number one. Yeah. And you're just walking straight in? I'm just opening that bad boy and just walking in. 
All right, so as you walk straight in, there are over 60 arrows that are launched directly at you. Oh, boy. Do you have a good dex? Yes. <laughs> I'm going to face palm. So I'm going to go ahead and ask you to roll dex. I'm going to give you a benchmark of 25. Uh, 24. Oh. All right, so you're only going to get... Oh, plus 26. And you're oh, and great. 27. Yeah. My bad. You punch the arrows and Actually, dodge and that's flip. A, that's an AOE too, so he gets another two. He's got so 30? You flip and turn and flip out of the way. <laughs> that's great for you. You didn't get killed by any arrows today. Hey, it rhymes. But mostly just an empty room with small cylinders that you see burrowed oh, into there's not the people. wall. So like a booby-trapped a door. Booby -trapped I thought there room. was a people in there. Just Indiana okay. nope. used it. it was almost like you just opened the door and then a mechanism mm -hmm. went off and launched all these arrows at you. But there's nothing else in there, right? Just the wall with all the... Correct. Alright. John Wick. Nix. Nix. John Nix. Yep. <laughs> just kidding. Alright, Nix. Which room did you pick? I picked four. Okay. So you open the room, um, you walk inside, nothing attacks you, but okay. you do recognize that you're just in this room, but I'm going to need you to roll con. Benchmark 25. Not dex. You can't dodge it. Correct. Okay, uh, I got 20... Four, unless elusive or evasive applies to this. Not within the Your armor structure. does, though. So My, you, get, uh, you okay. got a plus one for armor. Then I hit 25. Okay. So you would just notice that something smells a little funny. You feel I, a little woozy, and you just want to get back out. I'm going to back back out of the room, but I didn't see any doors out of here. No. Okay. But it was a strange haze in the room. Okay. Okay. Mr. Quinn. I. You had room number five. Yep. Just walking in. Well, I opened the door and rolled 27 for, per, for perception. You very easily perceive this very large carnivorous beast that is charging at the door. And I shut the door. <laughs> As you shut That's the door, you notice that the... Like it slams against it, it rattles it, and it continues to now. Let's go that way. Away Did he from. see any other doors? No. I don't care. No, he rolled a 27 perception. Was there any doors in the room that sat behind the carnivorous There was a very large carnivorous beast That's that he, he could took see. notice of very and then instantaneously the and then shut the door and tried not to get eaten. Right. Uh, but it is slamming against the door now, so you're going to want to hold that door shut. Or go through another door very quickly. Or go through I, another door very I will, quickly. I will hold the door. You are very strong. Yes. All right. Sneaky. How are you feeling, Ace? I don't picked know. room number three. Mm-hmm. And as you enter that room, you notice that you are in another large room with several blocks, like stone blocks that make up the floor. Four by six. So four across, six long. Mm -hmm. And each one of those blocks seems to have a letter carved into it. Mm. And a door on the, on other, the other side. side. But Ooh. nothing else about it seems to be dangerous. It seems like the way we should go. It seems like a puzzle. This is like so, a scene in the end, Jones. Yes. There's only two other there's only two rooms that have another door. So this there's one the in room mine. that she entered yeah. had another door. But and hers had nothing. It was a dark room with another door, and then yours, which has all of these blocks on the ground that have letters on them, and another, and another door. door. So potentially the arrows, gas, beast. So potentially the one that looks like a maze to get to the door would be the one that we should go well, in I because, would... I mean, unless the empty room, I mean, we didn't go in it. We just looked. I mean, you just looked in. It could have had other things Maybe that we, we didn't see. I want to figure out. This puzzle. Are they letters that look like they could spell something, or are they just random letters? Are we all entering this room now? 
Did you tell us about that? I'm holding the Well, door. yeah, I'm going to tell everybody. Am yeah, I'm curious. Am I in curious. communication, walkie-talkie with them? Or am I or, being so like... So you're going into that room? Mm-hmm. Attacked by like emaciated is. monks. Why well, have a puzzle floor if there's nothing on the other side? But it could also be just, you know, to throw you off because yours right. had another door so, too. So, can you move this... All right, so as Sneaky McNinja Sly walks into the room, these are the floor panels that she sees, and those are the letters that she sees. <clears throat> what, what do you guys see? A bunch of letters on the floor. I know, but what are they? L-E-L-H-A-A. -A. Oh, okay, that's U? an easy puzzle. Zero... N V S T D it's such a bunch of letters. Go by each row. So the first row is, is R. R. Yeah, the first row is R S R F, then E E O R, D T E G N V S T A A U O L E L H. What are we coming to steal again? The what's it called? The Golden Flame. flame. Golden flame. Okay. So it's I would like to say Waro. <laughs> Hey, That's couldn't we just like, you know, bring like some like uh, wood with us and like kind of just. Like, well, you're in the front of the temple. You don't know. I know. What's in well, no, I, he's we trying have to help call. us. Can I take a picture of it with my PDA and send him a picture? Yeah, we got mine. Call. OK, yeah. You see a room with a whole bunch of bricks on the ground that have letters on. Cool. I asked the monks, like, what does this mean? What, what's all this? I show it to them. Where's the door? Is it like. Somewhere you suddenly hear here? static it's as his right, PDA is taken away from him. Like, uh, <laughs> he seems to be mobbed by monks. Where's the second door? Is it is the second door behind one it. of these letters? Nice knowing you. It's it, it's just at the opposite end of the room. Okay, so, so like the obviated. door doesn't start at a specific letter, and the door doesn't end at a specific mm, letter. Correct. Okay. If there was some sort of legend or key, that would be maybe needed to find. To solve the floor. Can I roll perception to look around on the walls or ceiling? Of that room? Yeah, to see. Sure. So now you said of that room, and I'm just wondering if it's in another room. <laughs> as, of yet, as of yet, we have not found any kind of technology, right? Correct. No, mm -hmm. I see nothing. I'm too stressed out about this puzzle. What'd you get? Like a. 11. Well, here's this for you. What's the best mark for Are you compelling me, or did I fail epically? You did fail you epically. You did 11. It's all so 25. as you did that, you're trying to, you're trying to look around inside this room. What? You step on a letter. You stepped on a letter. <laughs> Which one? Well, show me where you're at. You didn't put me You anywhere. stepped on the F. And you feel like it's it's starting to raise you up. Ooh. The floor panel is actually raising up towards the ceiling. What's on the ceiling? Is the spikes spikes? Is f up? <laughs> it's not the f, guys. But yes, there are. The, so it would don't be bad step to hit the, the ceiling. An R and an S. Can I get off of it? I mean. You can jump down to jump down. the regular ground. Jump down if you want to. I mean, it can't be raising that fast. You might want to roll a 25 on dex, though, to avoid jumping on any other letters or hurting yourself. This is not going so well. while she's rolling, I rolled a 25 for perception to look around. Okay, That's so... A stone on the wall that has you know, something. You look around, like. you notice that his room seemed to have arrows. Yep. His room seemed... He, t he says, oh, don't go in there. It's kind of whatever. It stinks. Gas. You notice that your room had a beast that was going to eat you and is still trying to hammer through that door as he is holding it shut. And we'll right. get to his strength roll here in a second. And you notice that there was another room that was opened up and quickly shut and then walked away from that had no mention. And there was nothing in it except the door. She seems to be in this room with her now. That is of important notice. <coughs> 16... I got a 19, so I didn't, like, die when I fell off of 
You didn't hurt yourself as you landed. Um, you managed to avoid landing on a brick, but you definitely took the wind out of yourself okay. when you hit the ground. I'm good. I'm fine. So you're you're gonna need a second to take your resolve yourself, so you'll miss one turn. He's had a key, so there's got to be like a key somewhere. How many le how many letters across to the door? Six. There are six stones towards the door. There are four stones across between the walls. You can do the math on how many stones there are total, but I don't think it's going to spell anything. Four times six. Just from looking at these, unless I'm spelling really badly, I don't think it's going to spell anything. It's going to relate to something weird, something from somewhere else. How many rooms were there? But there, there's five, there and there's five, five levels. So each room could have. They like found a, piece a trap of the in three rooms. They found these letters in one room and a door in another room. Each As room could give us another letter. I like think S is the first letter that we used. Why? Do what? They haven't looked through the door. The one, the room that well, had another door. Yeah. yeah. No. They haven't I mean, that. you can't step on it. I can't. This turn, no. She thinks the first one is S, but let's. But I think that if there's five thingies and there's five rooms, that's gotta be not five. So thingies. what's there's the letter? Six. Huh? There's six of these. Yeah, there's four. There's uh, five there's rooms, a, but there's also a main hall. What's what are the letters in the second row? Two E's, an O, and an R. Your. Gets S. Okay. All right, give me a roll for your strength. That's going to be a 30 to hold the door shut. Can you make that roll? That, we're going to have to attack this beast thing. Just one person? Barely. You're just leaving one guy to Is hold it possible that for you to well, do it? Well, he's super strong. Yes. Then I What's can ask strength? you to do it. Oh. So yeah, he can't 30. ask you to do it. He can't you ask you to do it if you couldn't. That is a no. If you couldn't meet What'd 30. What did you get? Um, 16, 18, 19. Okay, so you definitely didn't get it. Yeah. What color were you again? I'm green. green. I feel sorry for you that you failed so poorly. But that means that you don't get to deflect any of the action uh, or the uh, force of the creature that bursts through the door. And what you see looks like a cross between a wild boar and a hyena as it bursts through easily weighing at about 280 pounds is a large creature okay but as it bursts through it's going to give you an automatic four damage to your health because it basically bashed you into the ground but you soak one for your armor right you have your armor so you'd soak that and then the rest would bleed through all right so it has bashed you into the ground it is snapping gnawing barking and it is looking to eat oh, anything fleshy now no, so out of Wick. What is it? Oh, sorry. Nyx. The beast that is What's in there. You kind of just said it was like a big have? beast. What is it? It's a, it it looks like a cross a between a wild boar and a hyena. Did you already say that? I did. Sorry, we oh, were, we trying were talking. We are trying to figure out how to. It's all good. That would be we're not out there. That'd we're be not true. out there. You're in this room and you're distracted. All you hear is. <laughs> <laughs> What I don't want to. Is there a lock what on the door? Can we again? lock? <laughs> <laughs> can we lock the door? <laughs> lock everybody out. Yeah, you can close the door behind yourself. Wow. Oh, you should, I couldn't help them, but you should go help them. <laughs> they kind of fight this thing. I'm not very strong to bite. I can't do anything with this turn. I can try and shoot can it. See the, that sure can is like not do nothing, though. The room with the letters. Oh, he's going to compel you. You really wouldn't want to help anybody mm -hmm. because you don't want to help anybody. You just want to play for yourself. I don't want to help anybody. Except she's helping me. You're kind of mad so that they even sorry. checked that door at this moment. Like, they messed up. They're screwing up your job. Exactly. Yeah, that's their fault. Right. Sorry, not sorry. I'm going to keep looking at the puzzle. However. Yeah. Oh. I was, like, <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. It's gone. It just disappeared. <laughs> we get through the, the door. Eat the dory. Am yes. I saying that right? Eat a dory? Eat a dory. Eat a dory. You would be willing to die for people 
Yes. You would want to protect these people from dying, especially in your close proximity where you have to see it. <laughs> yes. The reason why I'm reaching out. So, right. it's kind of like you want to do what's best for everybody and, and take this thing on by yourself. I will, yeah, I will attempt to do that. I'll cheer from the other side of the door. You got this! <laughs> Not really. <laughs> I would, oh, you. I would do that. <laughs> I <laughs> forgot your name already. I'm going to pull out a flask and be like, they totally got this. I'm going to share it with you. Yeah. All right. So you two are closing <laughs> yourselves in the room with the letters. Yeah. I, I can't do anything. She closed the door. So I'm yeah. going to close the door and lock it. Uh, before I get to you, uh, Mr. Nix, what would you be doing? I'm probably going to shoot this thing. I have You're a laser pistol. Right? Yeah. I'm invisible and I'm going to try and. So you'll him, probably try to help him. Help him from behind. I'm going to like go behind it and try and shoot where, so he can't see where it's coming from. Okay. So and uh, Mr. Quinn. I'm in the room looking at the letter. So you're with them in the yeah. letter room? I didn't yeah. know that was a thing. Got gotcha. you. Yeah, What's the thing? It was the assassination one. But it didn't work for your character for another reason. I forget why. All right. So, so Quinn is... Where, yeah, what is you're going head to head with this thing. He's in with us. Uh, it's already attacked you, so it's up to you to attack He's back at this moment. No, no, yes. like, which so you can roll for your attack, and room. you oh, can go ahead and just roll with pistols. We use dexterity. Right. So just beat a 25 on dexterity, and you have your five. accuracy on Whatever your pistol. Um, okay. You go ahead and roll your attack. Is it going off strength? Uh, yes. All right. So you're just going to want to roll your... Do you want me to flip the thing? Roll your you'll roll first to see your success and you'll flip that when you're done so for just hitting it you're just looking at a 25 it's big it's ugly it's loud you can see it having the t box 26. marked in does that give me any kind of a bonus do what? having the yeah. t box marked 26. in does that give me any kind of a bonus and then if you want to uh t is trained it basically doesn't give you a bonus but it doesn't give that? you a disadvantage okay. oh oh divergence is I think that works too. That's just two plus two to brawl, right? Yeah. Yeah, so that's 20. Uh, 28. Excellent. So you succeeded. Go ahead and flip your chaos die. Mm. Uh, no, it does not work. Okay, so you're going to give out your base simple, damage right? yeah, without base the additional. Damage. Yeah. So what's your base well, damage? I wonder. Write that down. Here's, it's just a thought. I forgot uh, to, because it wasn't a weapon, so I forgot. If you start okay. from the so cool. door. But if it's like um, Fisto. But he's he's like a Fisto. Yeah. yeah. So I would say eight a damage T. for you. Four. You're basically using them like heavy weapons. You've trained into them. E if you actually e succeed yeah. in your e chaos e damage, S then you're going to take their damage T plus your damage. E or Easter. All right, so you're doing eight damage. It's uh, hit 25. It's, yeah. 25. So it's a good. Excellent. I don't know if it's so right. So it, it's a pistol. Did you write down damage on that? I didn't know no, what damage. Is it good. like a big see. pistol, like Rick would use for Walking Dead? Or is it like... No, it's a laser pistol. Yeah, he says laser pistol. But six? I'd give it a six damage. All right, so eight plus six. So basically, you sit there, you run up, punch this thing right in the face. You go, and it kind of seems to be like confused for a second when all of a sudden it's back haunch <clears throat> and you see the singe just kind of like coming up like black smoke coming off of it as its whole back haunch mm -hmm. just a chunk is blown off Ow. so that was excess success yipe, yipe, for yipe, both yipe, of you yipe. <laughs> <laughs> all right these are the noises that these things make i'm sorry we're th all three in the room i think all right, so all three of you are in the room, so we'll go ahead and go into your turn here for a second and see what you have to do. So there's nothing on the ceiling or walls, right? I can't roll, but can you all see any? Like, you can go ahead and mark symbols? off the F if you want to, uh, put an X over the there. The F is totally out. Because it is now lifted all the way to the ceiling. Uh, but y'all don't see any symbols? We could find rocks and throw them onto the letters and see which ones rise and don't. Are there rocks? There are no rocks. What about, I have this empty alcohol bottle. You want to throw the empty alcohol bottle onto a stone? Can we get it back? Depends on how far and how hard we're throwing it and whether or not it Do you have a rope? Busts. I have a grapple. Okay. So we can throw something and I can try to grapple it to get it back to it. Okay. I would not suggest the alcohol bottle. It is clear and made of glass. I'll allow it. <laughs> but 
But something else in your pack you could throw. Like, I have a scavenging kit. It's got, like, ropes and grapples and, like, a headlamp and stuff in it. But there's no, like, symbols. There's no, like, animals on the wall, painted on the wall. There are no animals on the walls in this room. There is only the letters on the floor. Can we throw something on a letter? Oh, like on a brick? I'll allow you to throw stuff at it, yeah. Let's try the F. What are we throwing? I don't know. That matters. I don't really need to grapple it if it's the S because it's right in front of us. We can just, like, push it with something. Can we like use one foot to push on it? Like yeah. stand and like, see what happens. Just our yeah. Sure. Like slow one half foot it. weight on it, and then yeah. I can't uh, do anything. But or, can you want to do, do that? that? Yeah, you can do that. What, what does it do? To do? All that? right. So as you step onto this letter, you realize that it starts to lift up. Okay. All, all the way. Like, just like F. Okay. It's lifting up to the ceiling. Trevular. Which one did you? Which I'll try the R. You're going to try the R. Which You're R? step on the R. Which one? The middle or the corner? The so, corner. Well, he's the gonna corner, have to start. Yeah, right there. <laughs> yeah, he's going to have to start at the bottom. Yeah, yeah. well, yeah, there's two R's. R's. The one in the corner. He has an idea that it's... A word backwards. A word backwards. Okay. All right, so you step onto the R. The corner yeah. R. Okay. Right here. So he steps onto the R. What happened? He's standing on the R. Come on. Ooh. Dun, 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 dun. That's the path he wants to take. Dun, 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 dun. Read it back. Read it read from it the top from the down. second floor. L A S T E R E A. L A S T E R. Sorry. Is that an L up top? Yeah. That was an E. It is an E. I yeah. Oh, Easter. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> I don't Easter? think that's right. Easter doesn't really relate to this. But it's we'll a temple. It is a it temple. It is a temple. So he is currently we standing on the R celebrate. and there's nothing they happening. Celebrate our Lord Can we Jesus all Christ. get on the R? Is this yeah. you? Yeah, we all get on the R. Mm -hmm. uh, Alright, so as you're all, they're all in there standing on one square, the R. Well, I don't want to stand on it. We don't need to all be on it. Okay, but so she's Well, you have on to stand on it to get to the next letter. Right, they're on it. Um, and we can only go to diagonal now of two different E's. Okay. Do I have a turn now, or am I still waiting? You're going to wait, because they're standing okay. on the R. Outside. All right, so the boar thing is going to attack you again, because you're the only person it sees here. All right, so as it goes to attack you again, I'm going to allow you to try and roll to evade it, or you can just block it, like grab onto it with your strength, or jump out of the way of it. That's your choice right now. But the roll that you're going to have to meet is 30. So oh, it, I can hit the 30 if I grab it. Okay, so you're going to try to grab it? Yeah. All right, so that's what we got. Um, can I use a chip? You can. <laughs> now, since we're after the roll... You can use the chip to re-roll, but just for future no notice for the rest of the night, and I should have mentioned this to you being new, you can use the chip in three ways. One, if you use it before your roll, you can actually mark down the difficulty by five. So if you're at a 30, you can take it down to a 25. Or you can use it to add two points onto your roll. So like if you rolled a 25, you have a 27. Or if it's after a roll, you can use it to re-roll completely. You can use one per turn. All right, yeah, that's fine. One chip per turn. That's fine. No, I'm just gonna... I should have mentioned that to you earlier. That's totally fine. All right, that's a little better. 28. 28 nice. is not a failure. Now, what happens as you grab onto this boar's tusks, like as it's trying to ram you, you two actually slam through one of the doors, and that would be the second door. You slam straight through that door into that second room that has a door and an empty room. 
and you're in there with the boar right now. Ooh, that was my room. Okay. All right. Nix. Shooting it again. Shoot it again. All right. So base 25. I'm going to use a chip to drop it. All right. So it's down to 20. You're welcome. Does a natural 20 do anything? <laughs> it does a lot. I, mean, I rolled a natural 20. All right, so you shoot this thing right in the head. Okay. Drop it right there. That would be, if it matters, a 28. Yeah, you did well. All right, so he drops it right there. You think it's him, but you just notice that this thing's brains splatter out and all over the walls and everything. And here you are standing in this room with nothing but this other door behind you. I'd like to check that other door. Do you see anything right. on the walls that looks like a key? Animal, symbols, anything. So you go to open the other door. And as you open that door, it's a dory. You realize that the floor drops out beneath you. This whole floor gives away. Uh, and you that's fall why I didn't down. go in that room. And you hit down at the bottom. It doesn't seem to hurt you, but it's very dark down here. And you're standing kind of like on a ledge mm -hmm. where you're at the door, and you realize that behind the door is a brick wall. Okay. Okay. Great. All right. Now we're going to go ahead and come back around to uh, Ace. Mm -hmm. You're standing on the R with this crazy guy, Quinn. I sent him a picture of the thingy. Can I check in with him before we get back around? The last you heard from him, he was trying to ask the people of the temple what was the meaning of their secret hidden room. And they took, and away from they him. took the comm away from him, and that's the last you heard of him. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Can I try like I did with Don't the S? Don't swipe left. Just kind of like slow. Well, you only have two options. Two E's. Yeah. So from the here, there are E, and an e. e, O, and R. She can't reach I can't these reach from this. here. Okay. So you want to go on to the E? The E straight in front of it. Okay. You get on that E. Does anything happen? You end up standing on top of the letter E tomorrow. Okay. Doesn't seem like anything's moving. So Crazy Quinn and Ace are now moving forward onto the E. All right. And what do you do? I am still concerned about this key that you mentioned. All right, so Kat's still standing at the front of the room, not stepping on these letters with them. I mean, they're not going anywhere. They're still going to be there when I get back. So I'm going to, I want to go check the main chamber and see if I see anything that looks like it might be a key. So you go back out into the main way. Yeah. Um, you notice that there seems to be the remnants of a battle that you easily heard on the other side of the door. Glad uh, I missed that. You see that the there's one, we one of the doors <laughs> that you were supposed to check is broken down now. Glad I didn't go in that room. All right. And you can roll for any more finite instructions. I'm going to use one of these many, many favors that I have. Okay. That was a good catch. Oh, oh my God. Well, She's going to need that back. I'm going to need a different lucky Well, once you use thing. it. I mean, yeah, I can I give can't. you one. <laughs> I don't think. How I can. bad did you fail? A one. I don't yeah. think I can get it back. I think I'm just. I just have a one now. <laughs> mm. Which I mean, isn't. You, like a, you. If I'm rolling off my scanner, it's like a 10, 11. I don't know what my benchmark was, but. All right. So, you notice that the main hallway is made of brick and stone and mortar. There seems to be some wood composite to the doors, <laughs> uh, metal bolting. I already noticed all this before. That's what you noticed again. That's what you noticed, what you noticed again. again. So I see nothing new. You see right. nothing new. Um, did you use your scanner to do this? Mm. All right. No. Oh, right. So I had to do the minus something. No, I was supposed to roll no you have to roll twice and take the lower of the two. Which I did, but I wasn't. How does that affect the fact that I just used a favor? You would roll twice again. Um, roll over time? If you rolled... I forgot I had to do that. Yeah, if you rolled with a favor... I don't think you're going to get lower than a 1, though. Right. Yeah, that's about as low as you go. So we'll let that stand. There's no negative now. on this die? There's no negative on the die. No. Yeah. There's no that zero. That would suck. That's as low that as you way. can go. You got it. Um, 
So yeah, noted. You succeeded you in getting the lowest. I got a negative seven. You used the signal from your scanner and got nothing Jesus. back other than what your own bare eyes would notice. Siri's mad at you right now. But my my you eyeballs. Call her Alexa too many anything. times. Correct. Because I feel like if there was stuff carved on the your ceiling, eyeballs I could see and it. the scanner noticed nothing okay. in this so main room. So there's nothing room. carved in the main room. Gotcha. gotcha. Itadori, you're in a dark space right now. Okay. Could I potentially jump? Out of it since I fell far enough out How to How far hurt. down is he? You could jump out of it, I guess, if you wanted, or climb um, on the walls if you wanted to. You should probably look around down there first. That's true. I guess before I do my ninja move out, I shall look around first, then to said pit. Do you have anything that might help illuminate the room for you? It's very dark. No. Do you have cat eyes or night nope. vision or nope. fire Flash or light. headlamp? I just hit very hard. All right, so he hits very hard, and that's that's all you've got right now. So, would you be communicating this to anybody else? I'm here. It's dark. I don't know what to do. Yeah, it's I have a grapple. Dark. I could feel around. I Wait, guess. he has. He's got I a PDA. Grapple out like a pen light and you shine down. PDA. And try and give him some light. Is there a flashlight built in the PDA? Him. Oh yeah, PDA makes light. So he's got a flashlight too, and he's shining it down for you. Uh, what you would notice is a trap door at the bottom of this. That takes you further away from us. Which is fine. Um, Just letting you know. <laughs> we can't really help you, you with you're going to jump, jump out. You're going to jump out? Yes. You don't want to check it and see what it is? Nope. You don't want to just open in. it a little? Yes. Like, just one no. eyeball. Like, okay. What if it's the golden flame? All right, so roll 25 <laughs> for dexterity to jump out. Leaving the trap door behind. 26. But we all know that it's there. You jump no, out. He knows it's there. And Did I he, know it's there, maybe. Does right. he communicate so to everyone you're else? There, you're shining the light, so you would know. He's, no. a, he's a loyalist person. You just see me do a cool flip out there. Okay. And you see him jump out. Nice. High five. It's up to you what you do now. Have you shut the door while the floor comes back? <laughs> that's a good question. It crumbled away. That's, oh. that's true. How far down is it? <sighs> Roughly about 15 feet. It's pretty far. Nah. Yeah. That's, that's not that far. Yeah, it's not that far. That's like a story? Yeah. 15 feet would be like a little bit taller than a normal uh, room ceiling. Right. Yeah, it's like a one and a half. Like a one and a half story. Yeah. <sighs> that's, that's not bad. That's like two of me. <laughs> It's a lot of me. I want to hang from the ledge. Five, two. And drop down and check the door. Three. Okay. You easily drop down. Doesn't seem that difficult to, to you. And you open up the trap door. Underneath it, you see an engraving on the floor. And what it reads is, there are three things, three things on Okrach that are inevitable. To be born, to die, and to feel... And then whatever that is seems to be scratched off. Can I take a picture of this with my PDA? Mm-hmm. Okay. And send it to everyone. Right. So you take We're that all like in a group chat. You're all in a group chat right now. Oh, right. I hate those. So I there you are. Them. You see what it, what he sees on the other side of that trap door, and it says there are three things on O'Clock that are inevitable: to be born, to die, and to feel blank. I like this Wheel of Fortune vibe. Can we tell any of the letters? <coughs> it's just completely blank. Like, can we tell? Is it six it's letters? It's out. It's just blank. Can you tell that it's six letters? Yes. Okay. Can I get an R? All right. Can we tell so the last two letters are an E and an R? <laughs> well, if it's I'd like to buy out, a vowel. If it's scratched out, you guys... Can um, we buy a vowel? No. I'm not communicating this to them. But you are in the main room again, standing on... Uh, well, Ace, you're standing on the E... With Mr. Quinn. Right. Can I say that again? You could tell how long the word was. Like, we can only go to the diagonal order. What's the last like, one? Like, the ones that what are touching that? the ones that were You're on. You're standing on the E? No, right? like, what was the thingy on the, the scratch stuff? Oh, up? the poem? Yes. To, uh, when you are, when, on Okrak, there are three things that are inevitable. Yeah. To be born, to die, and to feel blank. But... We can only go to the ones that are touching or diagonal, right? We can't. 
like. So if we're at the E, we like can only we go to, T go to or like D, right? here. From... You can jump across them, I guess, like run across. Well, there's no way you can go from an E all the way to the G, right? That's like, really, yeah, that's, that's a far jump for someone who's five two. You'd have to get across those other steps and find out what they do to get to that one if that's where you're wanting to go. Okay. Well, this is made a lot more complicated. Yeah. I don't know. <sighs> Is there an F on the top row? Nope. Mm. Did you want, me, you want me to take a picture of it? So it well, if all the letters are fair game, I guess there are a bunch of us. We could work together to... All right. And you can all work together, but we're going to find out what they discover next time. Don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. My name is Tony Stevens. I want to find out what happens when they step on the wrong letters, but if you're a listener, you might want to hear them actually solve the puzzle of the room in the great temple of Okrach. Until next time, tune in on the same Saturday Night Gaming channel, same Saturday Night Gaming time. Thank you, and good day.